Hey everybody, this is Danny Schneibel from Budget Band. Just wanted to do a quick little video here on um, a very important part of my life as far as a performing guitarist and singer is guitar picks. Um, I'd just like to know what your method is for not losing guitar picks. I am always losing guitar picks. And sometimes I've even gotten to gigs where I don't know where my guitar picks are. And I've even gone so far as to get like an old, like uh, like one of those membership cards from the grocery store that they're always trying to get you to sign up for, like the gas stations. And sometimes I'll even go so far as to just get like a scissors and cut it out as best I can in the shape of a pick and it never is. Um, and then it's just, it's not really a very good guitar pick. It's not horrible, it gets the job done. But uh, yeah, have you ever had to do that? Um, so probably a few years ago, a good friend of mine gave me one of these things. It's something I put on my keychain, and it's uh, just a little pouch. Some of you probably have these already. <laughs> Maybe I was just late on the bandwagon, but if I can get it off of my key thing here. This thing's so dang tight. <laughs> see if I can get it to focus on it. This thing here, it's, uh, it's basically just a little pouch, opens up, holds your guitar picks, and uh, I usually find myself putting whatever guitar picks I find around the house in it, like so. And I just stuff them in there. And I've got all different kinds. I've got, you know, just depending sometimes on the type of song I'm doing, I use medium or heavy. I really do like Dunlop picks, the tortoise ones. They've got a little bit of a nice texture, grippy texture to them. But yeah, I mean, guitar picks for me, it's not like I'm not super <laughs> not super picky about it. Mm -hmm. And uh, the only thing I don't like in guitar picks is I don't like super duper flexible ones. This one's really just too thin. Once in a while it's okay if I have to. Um, also super heavy ones, like ones that don't have any flex at all. I don't even have any of those on here. Um, mostly because I'm kind of a hard guitar player. I play, I strum really hard and pretty tough on the strings. So I like a medium to, you know, medium light guitar pick. Definitely just buy them in bulk. You know, they're not that expensive. Get online, get on Amazon, get on Guitar Center, wherever, Sweetwater, wherever you like to shop. Um, or if you have a local music store, get out there and support them. You know, you know, you can pick your friends, you can pick your nose, but don't pick your guitar after you've picked your nose. That's basically all I'm gonna say. Uh, I like the Dunlop ones a lot. Those seem to work really well for me uh, as far as the texture goes and uh, just how well they, um, you know, just how durable they are too. They've got a nice feel to them. They're just really bright on the strings and uh, they're good. I'm not too picky, no pun intended. And uh, sometimes the you know people will like those nylon-y, they're very kind of plasticky Dunlop picks. I've never been a huge fan of those. I've used them, um, and they're fine. But I find that I don't get as bright a tone from the strings with those. Now, some people might actually like that. They might like a more muted, softer sound and so those work well. So it really just you know comes down to your preference. Go to a guitar shop, buy like five or six different ones and bring them home and try them out. See which ones sound good, feel good, um, are soft or as hard as you like them to be. And uh, you know maybe uh, you know have a variety. So for different styles of music you wanna play, different sounds you wanna go for. Oh, what else can I say about picks? So anyway, if you have any other thoughts about guitar picks, please leave them in the comments below. Uh, I'd love to hear your ideas, what type of picks you like, uh, you know, do you put your logo on your picks if you're already an established player? I've thought of doing that. Um, and you know, how do you keep from losing them? The reason I like the little keychain thing is because most of my gigs I go to, I have uh, to drive there. <laughs> so. I mean, I'm gonna have my keys anyway, so this is on my keychain. As long as I make sure I keep picks in there, I'm gonna be good to go. All right, that's it for me. Be sure to like, 
subscribe and if you want to hit the notification bell and hopefully I'll see you again soon. Thanks. That's basically all I'm going to say. <laughs>